All right, so let's talk about um, tricks and tips to play fast. Um, I'll say a word of caution. Um, be careful when you play fast. It's very easy to lose your hands and, and maybe strike the instrument too hard. I'll be the first to say that I'm very guilty of doing that, and it's one thing I've worked on a lot is just control, general control. So um, as you progress with speed, you should also try to progress with control just so um, nothing gets hurt in the process. So um, first trip, um, or tip, I should say, is going to be um, this technique I use with a left hand roll. It's going to be this kind of general idea where you get two quick strikes. Um, now when I think about speed, I try to think about keeping both hands extremely efficient and try not to have one work harder than the other. Um, so this technique for me kind of um, rides that. So um, to just demonstrate the technique, I'm going to do a simple walk down with my right hand. And then I'm going to employ the technique with my left hand. So it's going to be kind of like a quick triplet. Um, so it's going to look something like this slow. So the general idea is it's in between each note. So I'm just going to speed up. Now really my right hand is going to be the one that's going to be working harder. one note so for me it's a little bit of wrist action and just a little bit of finger movement the finger movement is just really just to kind of reset so as this one as my thumb is striking this finger is setting up for a strike and as this one strikes it sets up this one so that allows this kind of rocking motion to happen that can get going really fast. Um, now this, this technique can be put all over the place. It can be for nice little fills, for speed runs, um, percussive hits. Um, a technique that I use is, would be something like this. Um, I'll be doing kind of fills on the, the in-between side. So. Um, even though I'm doing percussive hits, what I can do is I can let this finger kind of cruise over to one of the tone fields and um, you kind of get this nice roll. So. So again, that one's very versatile, so I'll let you uh, use it however you will and work on it and, and, and bring it up to speed. So again, it's just a roll from thumb to uh, finger I use my index, excuse me, middle finger. Again, my right hand is the one that has to do most of the, most of the work. So um, that's one technique. Uh, technique number two is just going to be an individual finger roll like this or four fingers. Um, and this is um, a technique that I'll use to do um, kind of doubling stuff. Now as a, a cellist in my past I found that these fingers were already very trained to do this kind of stuff so it was um, didn't take me all that long to, to reapply that. So um, if you are a guitarist or anything like that, where you um, have this motion, this is maybe something that you can pick up quicker than you might think. Um, yeah, and I'll use it in stuff like this.
So you can go from something like this and fill. And I'll apply this on the ding as well in this, this fashion. this than this. It's more of a pulling. And it kind of almost balances and just resets. So I'll fill in with my other finger. Get this nice rumble. Um, so a little example of something to do with this. Um, is to maybe apply it like this, so... Uh, again, my right hand is the one that's going to be doing most of the work, so this is just more of a trick to make it sound like it's going fast. Double. So those are some general techniques to kind of speed it up. Again, it's, it's more of a, a fill, whether it's that way or this technique's nice with the thumb because you can alternate notes as opposed to just being on one note with this. Good luck.